Hey, we're here with uh, Martin's 55 Chevy. What kind of setup is this, man? What is it? I don't what, know, what man. What we got going on here? It's a little bit different deal. It is a little different deal. You're in the limelight, man, for yeah. once. This this whole car, this 55, kind of uh, goes in conjunction with the 42 story that, that Tim Hawkins told, I don't know, what, about a month ago, about Aaron Robinson. This was Aaron Robinson's car that he bought from uh, David Creasy back in the 70s. And it, it, it was in, it was Aaron, Aaron's collection. I actually rode in this car whenever Aaron was in high school, and I, and I came back from Colorado one time. It had a small block Chevy in it, uh, an old second all three speed, if I remember right. Robin Pascal, he'll be able to remember it. Robin, if he remembers some of the details of the way this car ran before, I know I know that it was just a temporary ride because it just had a gas can underneath the hood whenever I rode in it the one and only time. But anyway, after Aaron died, they kept all the cars. Everybody knows that story, and. Uh, I got it. I got it back in uh, somewhere in the somewhere in the 90s. Whenever one of the big floods hit, the Aaron's parents decided to go ahead and sell all the cars, and I went straight down there and got this one because this is the one I always wanted. It's a it's a 150 base model 55, originally a six cylinder car. Whenever I edit the video, I'll put a picture of what it looked like on there. Whenever I got it, but anyway, it's a six cylinder still though, right? Be what? Never mind. It's obviously not a six-cylinder <laughs> now. Come, come, we got we, we got Lauren Husky running the camera today. Lauren's Lauren's doing. He's our new cameraman. Come up here and look at this motor. I got the motor and rolling chassis from uh, from Vic Root. Vic called us up one day, called Tim Husky and I up and said, "Man, you guys need to come up here and look at this rolling chassis I got with this big motor in it." So I was kind of hesitant to go up there, but as soon as I seen it, I said, "I don't want that." <laughs> it's got an Austin rear in it, uh, or a rear subframe. It's got a nine inch Ford, turbo 400. The motor, all we know about it is, is Vic bought it from an estate sale, so we don't know what the internals are, but I mean, obviously the old boy knew what he was doing. It ought to run pretty good. I've got pretty well everything to finish the car except for the computer for the injection system. Uh, I, I need a fuel cell. Of course, I've, I've got all the wiring. Just need to really finish it. It's been sitting for a year now. We pushed it outside here at, this, at the undisclosed location today. Uh, but anyway, the guys here at Custom Models by Tim painted it. Brian and, and Bryce painted it, is what Tim Husky just told me. Hugo Sanchez and his brother Alex done all the metal work. And man, I don't have a key to the trunk. I'll show you what Hugo done on the inside. We can kind of see it from up here. If you want to walk around over here, Lauren, and we'll look at the interior. And also Donovan, Donovan at the Next Level Race Cars, he did the roll cage, put the seats in for me. Here, I guess I could run the camera myself for this part. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, check this out. This is uh, the roll cage was done by Donovan. Next level race Next cars. Next level race cars. And back here is the tin work that Hugo and Alex done. This is really excellent work back here. And like I say, man, if I could open up the trunk, I could really show you some cool metal work. But unfortunately, this is kind of a, we really didn't plan on doing this today, but we just had to move the car out of the way. But uh, anyway. God, one of these days, one of these days I'll get the damn thing running. <laughs> I was hoping to have it ready for SK-17, but obviously we're not going to make now. it. Yeah, obviously we're not going to make it. Uh, but anyway, there it is, fellas. Hopefully whenever Tim Hawkins gets the 42 running and I get the 55 running, we can take them up north or down south, one of the two, and hook them up. Who thinks going to win? Time travel. I don't know, man. Who do you think is going to win? I'm going to go with the 55. Uh, well, whatever. I'm not going to say anything and get myself in trouble. <laughs> he's, got the, he's got the weight advantage on me, remember? He's got Linko. Yeah, Linko yeah. and weight advantage. So. Yeah. He's a little bit smarter than you, too. Uh, I'll, I'll, go, I'll agree with that. That'll work. <laughs> well, all right, fellas. That's, uh, that's the 50, Aaron Robinson's 55 update episode right there. Cool. Yeah. You got any sponsors or anything you want to talk about? No sponsors today. No sponsors. No sponsors. This is kind of a special edition. This goes with this goes like I said with with Tim Hawkins' episode on the 42 yeah. Chevy that we've done everybody.